bad, but nothing changes. But uh, maybe a little change, but uh, I still the I I still mean. When you say you still mean, mean what? What to me is what you say. I am the self. Yes. And nothing changes. I'm still yes. me. Yes. So explain a little bit for me. Mm, the present, the present I is still there. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. So, what do you mean the personal sense of I? I mean, meaning and the 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 life that expresses through person. No yeah. identity. Not the entity. No, no, it's good. Not, not identity. Just like a old habit. Mm-hmm. Uh, some memory and um, yeah, just yes. yeah. All yes, that is fine. Let, let, let that be there. If there was a mistake, the mistake is in living, accepting being, this person, and all of its life and complexities, mm-hmm. and taking them to be f- fully real. Mm-hmm. So when the trouble comes, you go, oh, and so identified with your situations because of your identified with your person. Yes. If you identify a person, it is like that. The self is not the person. Mm. The self is not uh, not the person. This morning, I just made one contemplation no? for mm-hmm. you know, that <clears throat> sometimes when you wake up, sometimes you wake up. As you wake up, already the mind is up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The mind really, is up. Really. Ta 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 and so, what uh, sometimes people do is they try to control the mind, try to stop it, or try oh. to turn away. I said, yes. "Don't waste that energy, because the one who is trying to do it yes. is also part of mind. It's also a mind-influenced identity is doing this. Yes. It's still the person is doing that. Yes. Now, if if I was not talking with you and I was speaking with people that are first time." I would say, okay, maybe you do that. You try and you know, don't give so much energy and don't uh, not this. But for people in satsang now, I say it's very important. Don't give so much energy to try and change the mind. That's not the trouble. Let the mind be there. But uh, be in the place of being. Be uh, detached. Drop everything. Learn to drop it. Dropping the mind doesn't mean to take it and throw it away. It means leave it. Be detached from it. And just be the the space of being. You must know this space of being. It has no day. It has no intention. It has no age. It has no religion. It has no race. It is it is just the pure consciousness only. Because in every race, in every religion, in every person, in everything, the consciousness is in there. Like it expresses like as the mind and as the person. There are expressions in the in the field of the manifest field. But the pure consciousness is not that. And because it's not that, you're able to see the mind and the activities and the data. You can see it, but the more you are here, resting in the awareness itself, all that thing of the world and the confusion and the high nice and bad days and da 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 feels more like you're reading a book, it's more and more and more distant. More distant. This is very, very good. When I say it's more distant, it means you can still people say, Hi, how are you? And you can say, I'm fine and like this and but it's anchored in a deeper place of being. This is the whole purpose of your life in the highest way, is to be in the root, in the heart, in the being. Where you're before you are a person, but not a person, not not your not any characteristics even. It's pure awareness. And people in the world they don't know this. Even when you're saying, No, you're talking, no, 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 no. Behind this is pure awareness. It has no division, it has no preference. And people feel that because we get so used to having a belief, having this, having that, and all these different um, Ideas we associate with ourselves because of that, we become uh, very particular. You must be able to see through that. That you know, yes, yes. You can say they ask you where you're from. You can say I'm from this place. You know, what is your favorite food? You can say that, but now it's different. There's no pride. 
There's nothing. It's uh, it's it's okay. That language can be okay, but it's not the fact of who you are. You're resting in that. So more and more you you experience this, you discover you will not say, yes, I am. I am really the person, because the person actually is imagination. Mm. It's like cultured imagination, mm. practiced re- imagina- in a- imagination. So it appears to be something real, but it really is not. And the only way you will know that is when you are able to observe even a sense of person, but from some distance. Don't get involved in it, because then you see it is also mind. The person is also mind. Thoughts and feelings and prayers also mind. In the space of being, <clears throat> when you're, this is the important part. When you, are, as you, wake up to the, the the presence and power, and universality of the beingness itself, you see that life is unfolding perfectly. You're from here. You see. Sometimes you think with the person you have all the excitement, you have the dreams, you have the adventure. <laughs> They're all dreaming. In the beingness, doesn't need excitement. Doesn't need it. It is. It provides the joy. It is full of joy, full of peace, full of wisdom, but not mind wisdom, not collected wisdom, spontaneous wisdom, spontaneous freshness all the time, and peace is always present, and a love, not an objectified love, a universal love. People don't understand that. What universal love means. I can't explain. So rather than try to say, <clears throat> explain these things, you be this thing. Because your life, how you live, how you express, is coming from who you believe you are. You are a person, you will express your life through the personal identity. When you are in the beingness, in the heart of awareness, it's a different vibration that comes from you. When people meet you, they, 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 not everyone. Some people are going to be blind for a long time. But those who are waking up, they will recognize. They recognize that there's a higher presence, a higher presence. Just like when you meet people sometimes, some people you meet and it's nothing, you have no feeling. And some people you know you're drawn to them, but it's not because they look pretty. It's just when you are with them, you feel good. And that is the universality of being. When you are with someone who is awake, you, it is like a mirror to your true, to your deeper self. So that's the difference. So, yes, I, I will accept what you say from the place that yes, you don't have to go and change your life physically. It will be changed. It will the way in which it is being expressed will change naturally. But rather than changing this and changing this and changing this. No, you sit here, and then you don't have to change it. Actually, it is lived from a higher place of consciousness, and this is the. <coughs> when I'm in the sitting, mm-hmm. there's a feeling of uh, presence, but also not existing feeling of uh, body, mm-hmm. and and I found this a uh, strong attachment to the body. In the presence also. You are aware of it more. Aware. <coughs> because without your satsangs, you are not even aware of it. Mm. Because you don't question it. It just feels natural for you to the body is there and you accept that. Now you begin into your your awakening the consciousness. You begin to feel oh the body, why the body consciousness is still so strong. It's okay, don't worry. Don't try to work on that. Just continue uh, rather than trying to Get involved in trying to change something. Just leave all of that come, just in the beingness. You know, can you do this? Of course you can, but in the beginning it feels difficult because you're used to associating. A lot of struggles and (coughs) patience. If you feel struggles, you feel struggles. Recognize that they are phenomenal. You're 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 perceiving them. You are aware of them. It cannot be you. Whatever you're aware of, whatever you can see. Whatever the senses tell you, out there or here, it's, it's only a sensation. Whatever your thoughts, it's only thinking. You see, but you cannot change that from being involved in it. When you bring the attention into 
just being only aware. Leave the body. Even the body is to say, hey, hey, I'm here. Even if the body was to do this, it doesn't matter. It's okay. You don't have a fight with the world. Don't fight with the world. Only stay aware of it with detachment. And it will self-heal. It will self-correct. It will. It, this is the power of the beingness. It's not the person is trying to change his life to become. No, this is big, big struggle all your life. Learn to let go of everything. You know, not cynically, just detach from them, and you still feel. But I'm here. Yeah. Yes. But this eye is different from the other eye, which is mm-hmm. going. Yeah, I want this, and I don't like this. No, mm-hmm. this eye that is here is different. It doesn't have opinion. Mm. It's so it's universal. Universal consciousness means it has no preference. It is it is complete. It is the generator of all this universe. This place. Yeah. Just just to sit with it. Don't worry the person is so coming. That yeah. Still I can sense, I can perceive mm. this uh, feeling of presence. Yeah. So which one is You can the... perceive the sense of presence. Yeah. You see the things the, the The self is self-aware, no? The self is naturally self-aware, but it's not self-aware in duality. Mm. Just like you know, supposing you had an operation in hospital, and then when you're waking up after strong chloroform, you you know you you, you suppose you you're you're awake, but you cannot see anything. The senses are not giving any information. Mm. Nothing, nothing there, you know. Your eyes open. You cannot see anything at all like that, but you still know you are. Even even if memory is not there, even to say I I forget, is an is an awareness of something. Mm-hmm. Something is here. You must clean it from everything, from associating with everything. When you uh, you come to that, you'll see it not with eyes. You won't see it in duality. Remember this statement I saw this thing. On the wall, there. Come out the satellite here. Come in. On the wall here, inside, I, I see the poster. I am. It says no. Mm-hmm. I am. Before the idea that I could forget myself, or that I know I need to remember myself, before that was believed in me, I was I was distinct here. Mm-hmm. Before anything come, I'm there. Mm-hmm. Now everything come and I forget. Why? Because the same thing gives power to all the other things. Mm-hmm. But to come back to this, you must put some effort at first, because mm-hmm. of the habit of the mind, the strength of conditioning. Then you just don't fight them. Just learn to detach. Them. You see, just like when you came into them, you didn't put them on. You just slowly got uh, associated, and then it became normal. Everything become normalized. Mm-hmm. In the same way, uh, as you learn to let go of the attachment, not of the perception, but of the attachment, no? then you will come to see that even the act of perceiving something is also seen. What's been happening here? What's been happening behind? Empty, 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 <clears throat> but at the same time full, but full of purity and light, joy. You experience, and today you will do, do this. You will find this now that I talk with you. Yeah. You don't say, okay, for the next three. No, you go and you sit for 10 minutes, and take a break, go sit again 10 minutes, and tell me, come and tell me what you find. Okay. But you really do it. Yeah. You do it. Yeah? Good, good, good. Okay, good. Yeah, just do this. So you put yourself on top. Say, okay, at least ten minutes. Just sit and and go again. And it doesn't matter. The mind will come. The mind will come. When you have good intention, the mind will come. So don't get involved in it. Yeah, this stays. Yeah. keep coming. Yeah, no, it's coming because uh, if I can put it in this kind of term, it's as though the mind is afraid to be finished. But it's not true. It's not real. You understand? Just like you can see a ghost, and yeah, yeah, but it's not. It has no reality, mm. and uh, the mind and all of its construction they don't have any true truth, not reality, mm. but they still appear. You see, just like somebody you can meet someone, and they tell you something bad about this person. It's very wicked. 
man, this man, my dear, look at this man, dear. It's not good. Watch out, he's coming. Watch. And if you start to feel all the fear, you take their fear. Oh. Okay? And then uh, afterwards you go and sit down somewhere. And then somebody else come and they're talking with you. And then the same man come and they say, Oh, have you met George? He said, No, 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 no. <laughs> Why? What's wrong? He said, no, he's the most wonderful person. The most wonderful person is here. He said, but no, but you know, no, he's 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 a, he's killed somebody. No, <laughs> who told you this? No, this man told me. Oh, him? Uh, yeah, because they are, they they don't like each other. So, so all this you experience, and it feels real. Your heart beating. <clears throat> what? It's not true. And we are reacting and interacting with many things. It's not true. It's all in the mind. And what the world tell you, people tell you, what you think, all of this is not true. Or it's different perspective, subjective opinions. People tell you, you believe, ah, oh, it's true. No, none of this, none of this is true in the way that I'm speaking. They are just uh, sensations, ideas, beliefs. You learn to detach from them. Don't fight. Detach, so they can, they can still be there. Because when you, when you wake up into your being. Other people will still be believing those things, mm. no? But you have to wake up. You wake up, and from your awakening place, when people speak with you, you can you will be able to speak more, not just with words, but with power. With the power come from there. Power doesn't mean no. The power can be very empty, but it washes the mind, no? because you have done it. Then you don't have to keep doing it because you have done it. It lives in you, and that presence is also speaking to people without words with them, because we don't see the evidence of the 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 presence of truth. We don't see because we're so full of information, mm. but we need to be full of emptiness. But the the full mind is afraid of emptiness, and oh, I don't want to. No, I want to find something. Mm. Nobody wants to find nothing. But yet, out of what I call the nothingness, all this world comes. And it's just momentary. Everything only momentary. But that which is the, the root of them is unchanging. You will come find that. Don't talk about it. Sometimes we talk about it. I made another thing. I said this morning real playfully, I say, your good intention is not your success, is not your achievement. So don't tell anybody your intention. Just use it, and uh, do it. You do it. You see, you don't even talk about it. Mm-hmm. Then it will introduce you. You go and do that, okay? Okay. And uh, you. I'll see you again, a little bit. No? Thank you. And then just, just share what you. Then you can share with me. You can tell you. The thing. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh. Man, you're strong. Oh, I want to do this. Yes, yes. You know, it's okay. But it doesn't matter. You're only reporting. Then it doesn't matter what is your finding. You still just tell me what you find. Okay. Just leave everything, including any idea you have about yourself, or your past, or relatives, or everything. Learn to be detached until you come back. Only awareness is there, unmixed with anything. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Find a place and let's you get there. Go and have some tea. Yeah. And come back. My activities. Yeah, there's a very clear segment between each other. Yes. Yeah. And and where 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 is the knowing of this happening from? I'm watching it. Yeah. As what? So, what is watching it? I I can't really put a name, but uh, I'm really in it. Yeah. I'm yes. just in it in both of them. You are the when 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 you are watching anything, you can watch is something. Yes. You are beyond something. Yes. You are not an object. You are not this body. This body you can see also. Mm. Yes. This watching is arising out of the pure awareness. Yes. But it doesn't need a body. If it has a body, it becomes limited. Uh, yes. That, that's why I find it. Yeah. Yeah, I can sense the difference. There's a discernment. Yes. It's very clear discernment. Yeah, it causes the discernment. It it's the this is the discernment is the nearest to it. Mm. Yeah? But it is not located. It's everywhere. Mm. 
It is. It doesn't have a farm. Yes. But because you're used to associating with a farm, yes. you say yes. But I can't see it. I can't. You see, you're assuming a, a someone to see something, but you are not someone to see something. You are that which is seeing, yes. but you have no form that you are seeing from. Yes. This is very important. Yes. When you sit again, uh, it will it will reveal itself like that. You don't have to be a, an an object looking at other objects. It's you are not an object. Revealing now. Yes. I can even, I don't know, be you are looking from vastness. You have no proportion. This body is okay. It's okay. It's looking at this body through this body also. But it is not the body. Tell me you what you see. In, in the beginning, I feel my my body uh, stretch. Yeah. It's stretch and. Uh, so the body won't go away. The body is there. Yes. Yeah, you see this. Yes. Okay. And, and uh, slowly, slowly, my body release. Release, yeah. release, and the and body is releasing, or something is releasing the body. Ah, oh, something is releasing the body. Yes, yes. But it comes the the head here. Yes, <laughs> yes. Straight, because <laughs> here you see it and release. Yes. And release. Yes, because yeah. you see, for a long time, yeah. you are living as though you are your head. Mm. You are not your face, mm. and you are not the one inside the face. Mm. Earlier than that, mm. the one inside the face actually is it's also awareness, consciousness, but mm. with 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 um, with quality, mm. and the quality is it's it's believing I am the body, I am the person looking, mm. but this body cannot look at anything. Mm. Just like you say, I'm, my eyes are looking. No, something is looking through the eyes. Mm. The eyes are instrument; they are not the seer. Mm. Mm. Clarify now. Mm. The eyes are the instrument, just like you put on your glasses. You say, I can see, but the glasses cannot see anything. Mm. So your eyes are like the glasses of the being. Mm. It will take a time to understand this. You see, you are looking through. You are looking through the eyes. You understand? Because of the the eyes are the instrument of the being. The being is looking through the eyes. It's the being that says, um, uh, when I say, someone say, my eyesight is like 60% in this one, 30%. Not the eyesight reporting. The beingness is saying the instrument is not the perfect here, not the perfect there. The subtle, subtle thing. So, because we believe we are, like, this is, this is your headquarters, no? Mm. We like we're living here. Mm. When you speak, you think you're speaking from here. Mm. When you look, you think you're looking from here. When you think, you think you're thinking from here. When you mm. smell, you think you're smelling. But all is coming mm. to the, from the beingness. Mm. You see. Mm. Don't worry, don't worry. You're doing very well. Mm. At the moment, you you still feel the body won't go. The body doesn't need to go. Mm. The mind is still there, and the mind doesn't need to go. When you see that you are not the mind, and that the mind cannot be seen without you, it is you who see the mind. The mind cannot see you. Mm. Mind is after you. Mm. You are watching the mind, but you say, my mind, and you think the one who is speaking is the person. But the person also is seen, is known. If you stay quiet, like I told you, don't associate to anything, you will see your person. And then you will know, I am not the person. I can see the person. And you will know that this is not new. It has always been like that, but you are not aware of it. Mm -hmm. um, as you are recording this thing, I am going to let you play this thing. You will listen over and over and over again. OK? Thank you. OK? Yes. You good? If you come for this, I am with you, I support you in this. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Thank you. This uh, satsang, short satsangs like this, very important, very much to the point.
and you know sometimes they open up a deeper understanding or recognition for people some people are going to be waiting for this satsang they don't know yet when they listen somehow it's like another is like another number in their combination ha ah, ha ha yes yes whoa i was seeing something in a different way and now i can see guruji says this now and ah it's it's uh, it's the problem no more i don't have the problem anymore. you see that's the kind of satsang Very good.